Good morning Angels, is Jack around on 94.2 so omge program en elke woensdag ochend so net voor 7 probeer ons die hand van iemand vat om hulle lewe so bietjie makliker te maak. Vanochtend vat ons die hand van een groep vrouwen wat hulle lewens daar aan toewy om na ander mense om te sien. Good morning, Angels. This morning on Jack Rattle 94.2, our Angels crew Dodge sitting at Gardner Ross right now. We're getting a new one Yay! from next week onwards, so we'll have to uh, wait for that. But for now, uh, we're going to go straight to a place we've had before on Good Morning Angels. Yes, it's in Yeovil. It's called Nazareth House. And this morning, we are talking to Sister Bridget. Good morning, Sister Bridget. Morning, Sister. Morning, my dear. We got a letter from somebody who works with you, Yvonne Bronkost. That's right. She's sitting here beside me. Yeah, she helps you with some fundraising and uh, getting the word out of what you are doing at Nazareth House there in uh, Yeovil. According to her email, Sister Bridget, you are looking after a lot of people who can't look after themselves. That's correct, yes. I know you are doing one of the projects where you actually go out to people's homes and uh, right. give them medication and give them help, especially HIV. I have three or four carers that work with me and we go out each day uh, tracing defaulters of HIV, AIDS and TB, people that do not want to continue with their medication and don't come back to the clinic and uh, sometimes it's very difficult to find them. They have either moved, um, they might have gone back to the homeland, they might have gone to another uh, clinic and they don't inform Hillbrow Clinic, or they might even be dead. Yeah. Nobody seems to be able to trace them. And that's and what you do, you, look, you go looking for them to, uh, to take them back to the right. clinic for help. That's right. We try to get them back as best we can if we can manage it. And I also just we also distribute uh, clothes and food. We get parcels of food made up from Sisanani, and we pay for it through Nazareth House. And uh, we give par- parcels of food to the destitute. I know also that uh, at Nazareth House you are looking after 30 HIV AIDS orphan children between the ages of birth and 10 years old and I mean that's full care. That's right, that's full time job here at Nazareth House. Yeah, and then there's also a hospice at Nazareth House, Uh, 18 adult patients are being cared for there. That's correct. Yes, and then also um, 1,800 members of the Yeovil Berea Hillbrow community who need help and um, also some elderly people that you're caring for. So really, really people who who would not have any help whatsoever at all. That's correct, yes. Let's just give you the good news, Sister Bridget. Um, from our Good Morning Angels Golf Day Fund, which will be topped up again from tomorrow, <laughs> we would like to give to you and Nazareth House 70,000 Rand to help you doing the good, wonderful work that you're doing in your community. Thank you very much indeed. We hope that it'll, it'll help you in your efforts. Sister, from Good Morning Angels Golf Day Fund and from Jacaranda, we're going to be giving you 70,000 Rand. That's seven zero. I think you guys said. Oh, <laughs> thanks be to God. <laughs> that will be absolutely fantastic. They'll, everybody will be very happy, and it will. I can assure you, it will be well spent. And and I think you thought we we said on the phone seventeen. Yes, the, I got I got the the number wrong, but I was. So this is much better. It's good news. Oh, it's definitely <laughs> a fantastic donation altogether. For more information, visit fatmyhand.co.za.